Good morning, modern steaders. I think that was the pigs making all that noise. I think the pigs like sleeping outside lately. Out in the pasture over here. There you're hiding. You waiting? Waiting for some food? I don't see a food dish anywhere. I think this is the first time I've seen the chicks eating out of the feeder. Morning, Andy. How come you didn't want to go in last night? That's some crazy colors in the sky. It's a weird morning out. You excited for flute practice? Yes. I'm excited to hear all about it. So is your spelling test today? Uh, yes. Okay, kick butt. Okay, I will. Morning. The herbal formula I've been giving Willow to help with milk production it smells really good. It's actually been making her eat her food a lot better. Figure we better check the pigs' water and make sure they still have plenty of water. Oh, we got a chicken sleeping in there with sausage. I don't know if you can see in there, but. About half full. Oh, I see Andy escaped. What's the matter, Andy? Was Moose beating on you? Huh? New York City's not big enough for both of you? Oh, uh, I'll let Andy stay loose and we'll see what happens. I don't think he enjoys being in New York City with Moose. I planned on once we harvested the pigs to put the free range and chickens in New York City. So I don't know what will happen with Andy come this fall. Hmm. I'll have to wait and see. Oh, I got more grain. It's one of them never ending things when you have animals. You need to feed them. We need to get these guys in the greenhouse so we can get the fence. I want to get a new setup going for the turkeys.
stuck in the grass pretty good. Ooh. secured in here at least new doors on got our old feeder that's what I want to do I need to take some wire and wire their roost in place I'll do this side you turkeys ready to get out? I bet you are. You guys ready to come out? You're free. Kind of taking a risk because I don't have an energizer on this fence. I don't think the turkeys will try to go through it. Trying to get all the air out of the pipe. That one's leaking. Oh, it's leaking. There we go. They're like a press fitting into the pipe.
hoping maybe the turkeys will figure this system out, especially if they dribble a little bit. We locked the chickens up so we can catch them and relocate them to New York City. We have two well summer chickens that are new last year. You'll be fine. There. Gotta let the ducks do their own thing and free range. Now one of the chickens, this one right here, the other chickens must peck its tail feathers and I thought it would heal up by now, but it hasn't. Ah, she's starting to grow back feathers. I think it's just taking time. There's one. These chickens lay some beautiful speckled eggs. Oh, Moose has got a new lady in town. He likes it. So I gave the turkeys a new home. I want to go check and see if they're still in there. A new home? Yeah, a new home. Let's go see. I think I know what you're talking about now. Oh, you think you know what they I'm talking about? Okay, so I saw that the ducks are out, and there's no fence around the garden, so you put them in a fence. And something else. And something else. And I something else. But I got one part right. You did. Oh, oh, hey. you put them with one of the old chicken tractor things that has like the big um. Ah, uh, we did. How was flute practice? Good. Good. Awesome. My spelling test, I'm not sure what I got on it. You're not sure what you did, got on your spelling test? No, but I'm pretty sure I got 110%. Okay. They seem to like it over here. Yeah. They're in the shade. I'll we'll have to check on them tonight and see if they're roosting up. Because I gave them a pole to sleep on. Which one's even the one that we originally started out with? The biggest one. So I think the one to the right. Mm -hmm. So that one over right back there. Yep. You got some big old eyeballs. Yeah. Oh, and Andy escaped from New York City. He's in with the pigs somewhere. He is? Yep. Oh, wow. I think Moose beat him up yesterday. That makes sense. Because last night he was sleeping on the nesting box. And he was a pain in the butt to get inside of New York City. Good job. Thank you. What a beautiful sky tonight, guys. Just look at that. Wow. And he found his new home. I guess he doesn't like that Moose is the king of New York City. So if that's where he's gotta stay, that's where he's gotta stay. Can't, oh, you can see him right there. Four deer we just spooked going over there now. You ready for your evening milking and your dinner? All the chickens in New York City are in, but the turkeys haven't gone in yet. I was hoping they were gonna go in the new tractor by themselves and roost. Shoo, come on, get in. We're so close. All right, we got them in, guys. Good night. There's a nice roost. 
right there for you. That's what I call a success on our first night in the new chicken tractor. That's where I'm gonna end tonight's video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye. Mm -hmm.